thanks for checking out Balancing the Basin today. Um, like we talked about before, uh, the new water managers page is now up and running. You may have seen it over the weekend. And I just wanted to show you uh, a, a few details on how it's different from the old one. And as you can see up here on my screen, this is what the old page looked like. And one of the first differences you'll see when you open up the new water managers page is that the, schemat the pool schematic here is going to be the new emphasis and the content and details on the right are going to be moved over to the left. And, and you can see that example here as I go to uh, what the new water managers page now looks like. Um, as you can see, one of the best things that we, we have on, on the new page is the Google Maps functionality. And I'm just going to quickly go over what that means here. You have a two scale uh, uh, image here of the, of the basin and Google Maps actually allows you to see that by your choice through a map or satellite version. Um, you also have the uh, zooming in and zooming out capabilities here so you can go look deeper into the basin and uh, and once you pull you can actually click and drag the screen and see anywhere you want around the basin and then if you want to get it back to how it was um, you can just click recenter here and I'm going to go back to the map functionality uh, so I can explain the rest of this. All right, so the biggest things you'll notice here is that uh, it's to scale and we've got the basin boundaries here and we've even got the sub boundaries. So I'm going to zoom in a little bit and you can kind of see up here we have Hartwell and then this is the Russell boundaries and then Thurman and then all the way down through the basin. And uh, the gauges will show up here in yellow and then uh, you can also see the, uh, the dams which will show up in blue dots and these are actually functional uh, dots that represent the gauges and the dams. I'm going to go ahead and close this out and just you can take, we'll take a look at a couple other things. If you click on um, this is Hartwell and you can see the outflow is coming out of Hartwell here and we can do the same thing for Russell and then this is Thurman. I'll go ahead and click on that and you can see what the Thurman outflows look like as well. And finally, uh, Google Maps uh, allows you to get so deep in to, uh, to the map here, you can actually just click this person right here and drag it to wherever you want to be, and you can get a street view um, of that section. It's so now you can, can actually see what that particular area looks like if you're walking or driving around. And this is right here on the Water Manager's page using Google Maps. So that's most, uh, mostly the, the functionality of the map. Uh, you can go in and play with it and have a good time with it. Over here, uh, we have just the same information that was available to you on the older version of the site. You can still see the current elevation and what t today's precipitation was and the monthly precipitation, as well as some of the other things that are really popular, such as the 10-week projection and the declaration. Um, and, uh, and of course, we're open to your feedback. Uh, if, if there's something that you'd like to see, um, give us a suggestion. You can post a comment here on the blog um, or, uh, or shoot us an email. Anyway, thanks again for visiting us on Balancing the Basin, and we look forward to hearing back from you.